I'm here with the Polaroid Z2300. As you might expect from Polaroid, it's a camera that also prints. So Polaroid's been doing these for a while now, but this one is a little bit nicer looking than their previous stuff. It's a little bit cheaper. It's about $150. And it's got some higher resolution, a little more uh, powerful specs than its previous efforts. So the way this works is that you load it with film right here behind the screen, and then you pop it closed and turn it on. It's got a couple different settings. It can take 720p video that's just stored on a card or on the internal memory, or you can take a still shot here. So you can take a picture here, and then you'll notice that it doesn't print automatically. Instead, you go to the menu, you can choose how many prints you want, and then you just make your selection. It takes, they say, less than a minute to print. It's actually fairly fast, but you do have to wait for the whole thing to come out. It looks very similar to the original Polaroid, but it's in a different form factor. It's more rectangular. It doesn't have the white border on it. And you notice that the screen colors go a little bit strange. Um, that's because this is a pre-production model and there are still a few bugs. It's not coming out until August 15th, although it's available for pre-order. So now you've got the whole picture and it's got a sticky back and is using Zinc, which is the company that partnered with Polaroid for this. So once again, here's the new Polaroids. They're up for pre-order right now and shipping August 15th.